Thank you for joining Significant Impact Monthly. This is the interactive session. This is our May session. And I've got so much to pack in today, but this is good. Um, most importantly is to make it interactive and get you guys accelerated, generating some momentum for your world. And uh, so I'm going to start uh, with this by first describing significant impact, as I usually do. But it's really important to remind ourselves what that means for us. And so significant impact, first of all, I'll start with impact. Now, impact can be uh, a lot of things. It's like, how, how much impact am I having in the world? But I'll remind you that I'm a scientist at heart. Mm -hmm. I'm a graduate of Purdue University uh, and uh, in chemical engineering. And so when I think about impact, it literally is defined as the kinetic energy transferred between two objects. What? So kinetic energy is the energy that that you bring to something and then you transfer it to another object. That's what we're doing here today. And remember, when you show up with a little bit more energy, you're gonna have more impact. That's how that works. So significant impact. And then the part significance is like, oh, what's significant? It's this, it's that, it's something else. But again, I'm gonna go to a very analytic definition of that, a statistics definition of that. Significance or statistical significance is deviating from norm or expectation, which means we are a community of positive deviance. That's what we're here to do. We're creating positive deviance in the world. And so that also means that I heard this great quote from uh, uh, the president of Purdue University, Mitch Daniels, the former president. And he said, you can't lead from the pack. And so as, as leaders in the world, you know, sometimes it feels kind of like I, I'm kind of out in front of things and I feel kind of like I'm out there, vulnerable. Yep, that's what you signed up for. So that's what we're in the world to do to create that significant impact. Deviance, but also having that positive impact in the world. All right, so given that, having that positive impact in the world, I'm going to ask you, Sean, what's pulse of the world right now? What do you think the pulse of the world, what's it feel like to you in your communities or the people you're around? 